Alright, so today we're looking at an artist named Bruce Gray, and he has made some awesome abstract art pieces. I'd like you just to look at these real quickly to see what kind of abstract art pieces he's made. Bright colors and lots of different kinds of lines. We're going to make one that looks kind of like squiggles. And if you finish that one, you're going to make one that looks kind of like raindrops. We're just going to have a piece of white paper and a black oil pastel. Remember that these oil pastels can get your fingers really messy, so you only want to hold them with two fingers and carefully draw on the paper. I'm going to fill your paper with lots of squiggly lines. They can overlap. They can go top to bottom, however you want to have them. I have at least three lines on there. I'm going to add in another one. It's going to be really swoopy. Like that. Okay, now, once you have your squiggly lines on there, you're going to set this oil pastel aside. And you're going to get some crayons. Everybody's going to have a set that they can share with the person beside them. You're going to start coloring in these sections, but there are some rules. You have to use at least five colors. One, two, three, five. And they cannot touch each other. The same color may not touch itself. So I can't have green here and green here. So let me show you just a little where I have started coloring and how they're going. So, so far I've only used a couple colors. I've used orange. Notice it's not touching itself yet. I've used blue, it's also not to shit itself. I've used this yellowish. And then I just started a little bit of pink right here. And I'll keep going until my whole page is filled. I'm going to fill the whole thing with color. This should not be scribble coloring. You should be coloring it really well to look like one of those awesome paintings you did. Okay, what you can use to trace these circles around, such as something like this. You can set that down. Trace a circle with my black oil pastel. And then again, color those in. Filling it with all kinds of colors that are not going to touch each other. 